everyone, how are you all doing? I hope all of you are doing fine. So guys, I'm so sorry I haven't had any video for the last weekend. It's because at the moment I'm still here in Philippines having a holiday with my friend Lisa. <laughs> She's there oh. reading a book. But before I left Australia guys, I made a few videos, a couple of videos that I'm going to share with you while I'm away. So this is one of the videos guys, I hope you enjoy this. So at the moment guys, we're here right now in this beautiful hotel. You can see the background, high rise building. Now this is a complimentary of one of our good friends. I want to thank her. Thank you so much for this wonderful, beautiful hotel that you um, share for us. It's really very, very nice hotel and very lovely hotel. So guys, that's it for now. I hope um, you enjoy this video and I hope you can get some idea that you can apply it in your garden.
so far guys this is what i achieved rearranging some of my pots in this corner so i have this beautiful purple delight i love purple delight guys it's easy to uh, propagate from leaf and easy to propagate from stem so i also have in this corner here the it's a very elegant very hardy plant and it's growing clumpy and it's also quick to multiply and i have my coral jade in here this one starting to have a red tips as well it's beautiful and then i put a bromeliad in this corner now this bromeliad is also protected by this shade cloth so i hope it will be fine there although we have 38 degrees tomorrow and 38 degrees on friday but i hope that this shade cloth will protect this bromeliad and then i have the arrangement So it's beautiful arrangement guys i really loved it so i put a this beautiful crassula here i think this is baby necklace or something i'm not 100 percent sure and it has a beautiful color and then the lovely rose and i have an aloe in here as well and it has a beautiful color as well and then from here we have the Ionium Sunburst and then with some of this Purple Delight hanging from the side of the pot beautiful and then we also have this Baron Bold this is propagated from leaf and then I put some campfire there now this campfire has been attacked by mealybug so I already spray it with pesticide and we also have these agavoids it's beautiful rose delight another campfire and then at the back here we have this etna it's really gorgeous this Etna guys look at that beautiful and then from the bottom here we have this super bomb beautiful super bomb And I also have another arrangement here. So we have these ruby necklace. It's starting to uh, stress out, starting to turn into purple. And then we have the mixture of Echeveria here. I think this one is Beni Musume. I think this one here is Miranda. I just check <laughs> and this one here is another Echeveria Miranda there you go. so pretty really beautiful now on this other side I have the from here I have the big red this one is given to me by Miss LaDonna. Miss LaDonna, thank you so much for my big red. And another arrangement over here. So we have the sunburst. This one, I'm not sure what are you, what's the ID for this, but it is beautiful. I love the color. And then another purple delight. The beautiful purple delight <laughs> and some serum burritos 
and another crassula now this one here this is variegated before but it's too stressed to show the variegation and I have a aloe here that is ver variegated one it's beautiful aloe look at that gorgeous I love the variegation of that aloe so that's it guys so simple um, rearranging pots and now I hope that these pots in here will be protected by this shade cloth that I have here so that's it for now guys i hope again you'll be inspired with, with this simple um, arrangement that i made for you to share this weekend and if you love this video guys please give it a thumbs up and if you're my viewers and not subscribed yet please consider to subscribe it will mean a lot to me if you do so and also don't forget to hit that notification bell so every time we have a new video like this you will be notified and you will not miss a thing and of course please leave me a message and i'll get back to you as soon as i can so guys i'll see you next time bye